everyone welcome back to final fantasy 7 rebirth last episode we went through the mines so we entered from the grasslands and now we're going to exit into the junon territory that's where we're at we're going to junon today it's very exciting and i hope you guys are excited with me thank you for watching enjoy the video and i'll see you guys in the comments thank you so much Jesus, that's bright. Oh, wow. The whole gang's here. Hey. Junon region. We're here. Ah! We're here. Just them? I guess so. I thought that was a normal sized bird. That city they're headed to, is that? Whoa. Shinra territory. Come on. Chapter four. Whoa! Chapter three was super short. Dawn of a new era. Oh boy, okay. Now we got another open world section where we got a lot of side stuff we can do. <gasps> this is so neat. Where did that bird even come from, you think? There's a story about a great condor sent to roost on an island's abandoned reactor. Oh! There's no longer any way to reach the isle. Or at least, none that I'm aware of. They just finally reclaimed what Shinra stole. Well, even if we could get there, I'd rather not bother. Didn't seem very friendly. Agreed. Let's focus on where we can go. A condor, you say? All right, we will do a bunch of side stuff later for sure. Looks like we can go that way if we wanted to, maybe. Um, go towards our main objective for right now. Resurrect, thank you for the gift sub. We have to, uh, find our chocobo in this region ho oh ho found our first little rest stop <laughs> Chocobo's a different color in this place. It's like white. Are there gonna be different colored chocobos in each region? Region, I can't wait to explore every little inch of you. This whole game. This whole game, I can't wait. Alright, let's go. Where are we headed? I'm really tempted to just start off in one direction and just start exploring everything, but I know it's gonna be a lot better when we get our chocobo, so I might as I should probably wait till then. Okay, the owl wants to take me to a spring. Uh. Oh, hi, Chadley. Cloud. That's me. If you wish to proceed any 
further, you'll need a hardy mounted chocobo. Oh. Ooh, 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 okay. ooh. Sorry, bird. Our date is gonna have to wait until later. Ignilis. No! Oh, there we go. Wait to ice. Ow. Why is my HP so low? Are these guys that tough? Did I take damage from before? I should have rested at the chocobo stop, actually. Maybe we should do that real quick. <gasps> Look at this, chocobos. Chocobo Ranch. Perhaps you were already aware, but the chocobos here are raised on a diet of feed, seaweed, and fishbone meal. Unsurprising, Didn't know given that. the local industry. Phoenix is the next um, summon that we will get. For this region phoenix nice i wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel howdy care to give our wares a once over um so we can get a scorpion helmet breastplate and greaves but we only have four plumes so we can't really afford that Right now. Give that bird a pat on the head for me, will ya? What bird? I don't have a bird. I ain't got no bird. Uh, we don't have any of those points we can spend. Wind materia on cheap? I can't say no to a good bargain. Where's your shirt? Who are you? Wait, you didn't come from the grasslands, did you? Yeah, we did. You know, Bill, he helped us cross the swamp and everything. Do what? God damn it. I told that idiot to take his signs down. Swamplands are dangerous even on Chocobac. This guy I'm looks gay, like he needs some way. hydration. Owner of the ranch here. And before you ask, my birds are not for rent. Ain't worth the risk. <sighs> Used to run deliveries, but Shinra put the kibosh on all that. Still trying to keep it going best I can. Well, was trying till my carriage shit the bed. And since I don't have the parts to fix her, both she and my business are as good as dead. Even the chocobos are feeling down about it all. You know, I bet we could help you fix it. Kind of you to offer, but nah. It's just a matter of getting the right parts, isn't it? Says the girl who ain't gotta fix it. But even if you were some kind of secret grease monkey, I wouldn't be able to pay you for your time. I'm flat broke. Curious about my birds? I've tried setting them free, but they just keep coming back. Force of habit. <sighs> well, nothing for it now. Serves me right thinking I could run a business. Should have known it'd all fall apart. Jeez, hey, guy. Come on now. Don't be so hard on yourself. Yeah, you tell him, Aerith. Loud. He needs help. If not for him, then at least for the chocobos? Yes. Sweet. I wasn't really asking, but I gotta warn you, the parts I need are hard to come by. 
At least around here, they sure are. So where can we get them? From this craftsman at the top of the mountain. He'll have them. Can't go on foot, though. Only a certain chocobo can make that climb. Oh, really? Heard by the name of Belle. Last I saw, she was over yonder. And she ain't a big fan of people. All right. Does she like Let's lab roll. rat dogs? Let's go for it. You don't mind a short little Sorry detour. You into this, even though he can't pay. Not can't. Won't. Mm. Hate to break it to you, but I'm pretty sure that guy's better off than he looks. Wait, seriously? Are you saying I got duped? That he's just using me? <laughs> Afraid so. Aww. That jerk. A jerk. Whatever. I'm not doing it for him anyway. I'm doing it for the chocobos. Wrangle a chocobo. Oh, here we go again. Our favorite part of any game ever. Stealth mode. Which one is the one that we want? Oh, wow. I'm not looking forward to this. What does this do? I just run in there, fuck shit up, and get myself a chocobo? What's with all, what's with all this sneaking around? It's not my style. rock at the switch to flick it what flip it bonk <laughs> oh god go faster Is our bird okay how do we get this thing moving can we get this thing moving is there a switch somewhere i could throw a rock at or Around? Of course I have to go all the way around. So what is everyone's plans for the weekend? All right, now we just got to throw a rock. Something. Oh, crap. I was supposed to stay with the cart, wasn't I? Alright, let's not miss our chance here. Should we make this guy look away? No. Oh no. Come here, 
you're chocobo you're mine good bird friends partnership what's your name this isn't pico the chocobos of this region have legs and talons strong enough to scale certain cliff faces if you spot a surface marked with garish graffiti approach the symbol while on chocoback to scale it you can also climb down these surfaces oh yeah Perfect. Let's do a... Well, let's talk to the guy at the ranch. Then we'll go to the main objective here. Woohoo! I got me a climbing chocobo. That's not really what I wanted to do. Wait, what am I, what do they want me to do? Oh, right. I'm I was supposed to get materials for him. That was the whole reason of getting the chocobo. All right, well, let's do that real quick. It probably won't take long. I think it's right there. That's pretty crazy. Don't look down. Oh, we're going to go up high. chocobo too close to the stuff I'm trying to interact with. experience new region intel is now available oh well you know what i was gonna say i'll just read it in my own time but i kind of want to i'm i kind of want to know about the rise and fall of the republic of junon and so do you guys the people of junon were once largely seafarers who only returned to the shore to peddle the bounty of the ocean. Unlike other communities that settled in a single location and gradually expanded their territory, these sailors preferred the freedom of the open sea and over time banded together with like-minded souls to form a unique society. As a republic, they repurposed a flotilla of large vessels to construct a floating city that would serve as the center of their trade network. Having forged a robust infrastructure they then set their sights on using the disparate people's uh, 
uniting the disparate peoples of the world. Using and uniting are very different words. Though Junon ushered in an era of economic and cultural prosperity, it was not to last. Shinra's revolutionary Mako technology put paid to their ambitions, and their once proud city now slumbers beneath the waves. Hmm. That's rough. We made it. Let's see how high up we are. Woo. Can't wait till we go up there. Oh, he's sleeping. Wake up, buddy. Can I help you? We're trying to fix Gabe's cart. Oh, so you're looking for parts. Well, you'll have to come back tomorrow or the day after. I'm too tired to help you right now. Hmm. Think a swift kick could get him up? Wake him gently, make wake him with magic, or leave him be. Let's wake him with magic. Wake up! <sighs> well, you're not serious, are you? Uh, scared me half to death. <sighs> Do you want to get my ass up? Then you bring me exactly what's on that list, got it? Well, I say we get his ass up. <laughs> Use the map in your chocobo sense of smell to locate the materials buried throughout the region. Oh, okay. Hmm. Interesting. We're gonna skip that for now. No more distractions. Please. Aha. Uh -huh. So all of this is Junon? Everything above us. Below is under Junon. Little more than an impoverished fishing village. Huh. Vegas, Shinra's always gotta have someone to stop on. It's their friggin' MO. Under a steel sky. Let's, um, walk. Oh man, look at this. Oh wow, look at this. <gasps> Are we gonna see Mr. Dolphin? I hope we're gonna see Mr. Dolphin. moment hmm? welcome to under junon our sunless oasis my name is Rhonda. i'm the mayor and sheriff around these parts hmm. 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 
What? Avalanche, huh? That depends on who's asking. A woman who could turn you in. And be a hundred grand richer for it. I mean, you could try. Well, you know what they say. Can't take it with you. Hmm. Hmm. And Aerith to boot, huh? That's another half a million on top. <gasps> half a million? Down here, though, we know when to turn a blind eye. Yeah, you'd Consider be smart to do so. Sorry, but I call bullshit. Well, I don't think you would if you knew even half of what my town's been through. You don't like it? Leave. But over there, there's a quiet little inn where everyone's welcome. Any guys in black robes pass through? Not that I saw. Did see some black suits, though. Two guys and a girl. Looked pretty tough. Two guys? Well, well. Oh, right. They Sung was with them. Right for the elevator. Now we're talking. No, don't even think about it. In case it isn't obvious, upstairs is Shinra turf. And the same goes for the elevator as well. Don't ask me what, but the company's got something big planned up there, and security is tight. I like her hair. You start anything? Anything at all? And there will be consequences. Well, we're definitely gonna start something. Behave yourselves now. You'll be safe here. Relax. Okay, let's explore under Junon. And I'm guessing this place is going to be as huge, if not huger, than Calm. Maybe. Might be a little smaller, actually. It's so cute, though. Don't care what she said. There's got to be black robes around here somewhere. So how are we going to find them? That would depend on where they are headed. If they mean to continue west, there are only two ways off this continent. By sea or by air. Right. Might want to ask around town then. Locals will know routes not on the map. May have even seen stragglers pass through. Or got boats for rent or something. How about we meet at the inn when we're done? Sounds good. And remember, low profile. Everyone's leaving me. New Queen's Bud players await your challenge in under Junon. Let's go. Who wants to play cards with me? Wow, this place looks so neat. Hi, Red. Many years ago, this stretch of ocean was home to the Republic of Junon's capital, a floating city built atop a fleet of interconnected ships. Now, that once proud metropolis is mere flotsam, courtesy of Shinra. In its place, the company built a new, unsinkable city of steel to stand as a warning to any who might dare to oppose them. Or so I was taught. Many years ago, this stretch of ocean was home to the Republic of Junon's capital, a floating city built atop a fleet Sorry. of... Sorry. That's enough of that. I love watching that dolphin splash around in the cove. It's so cute. The dolphin! Mr. Dolphin! Listen. Heed the voice of our great mother. Hear how she weeps. Every location is just so intricately crafted. Word around town is Shinra's holding some kind of big event up top. Wonder what? If you're looking for them, for the people here, they hate the lack of sunlight, but not me. I like it this way, though I'd never tell them that, of course. 
word around town is she, she misses what. the steel sky oh hi chadley you know i'm beginning to think that you're following me around i see that you've made your way to under junon this town is quite reminiscent of the midgar undercity isn't it the severe mm -hmm. lack of sunlight being one similarity that's why Aerith likes it Ooh, we have some new materials <gasps> lightning and wind i need that item economizer allows you to use items without having to consume atb oh i need more data Needless lightning say, and wind many hazards await you on the road so take care many many years ago the Republic's capital city once floated on these very waters. That stupid cities don't float. Ah! <laughs> it was a large city with many people, built atop a series of connected ships called a flotilla. That does sound that super cool. Awesome. That's what I said. It was always rocking back and forth, back and forth. Uh, I think I get seasick. <laughs> you get used to it in time. So what happened to the floating city? Where did it go? <sighs> Into the depth. Nothing makes you forget a bad day like staring at the ocean. Dinra sank it in the water. Hey, I was listening to the story. Treasure? For real? What the hell? Care about the treasure? Okay, well, story time's over, it looks like. What's up, Barrett? Some fishing village this is. Ain't even allowed to take a rowboat out. Shinra's saying it's only a temporary prohibition, but people gotta eat. Anyway, short of stealing a boat and causing a scene, both us and our black robe friends are SOL. We should have never let them build a reactor in our waters. Nope. Whoa! Whoa, look at that! That is a huge Believe fish. Not, those bones over there came from a real fish. I'll never forget the day we reeled it in. Nearly capsized ten times over, but we caught it. That's crazy. Congratulations. That's super impressive. There's the inn. Hello there. Hello. Room for one. Oh. Please, please, help! What? Leave the inn. Oh, it's from outside? That sword. Anybody, You're some kind of fighter, please. aren't you? That was Priscilla. And from the sound of it, she needs a tough guy like you to lend a hand. Anybody, please, help. Oh, shit! Here we go! We gotta go! Now! There's a monster attacking the boat! This way! Down here! Oh god, we're doing this! Please, please! Where's Mr. Uh, Dolphin? Help! You <laughs> think? Here we go. Ouch. Hey, we're coming. She's hey, so tiny. She was wanted. Get rid of that thing. Say what? Barrett, focus. Get its attention. On it. the parts of the game that I've been looking forward to, like thinking about what's coming up. I 
Are we gonna have Come to on. do CPR on Yuffie though? I hope not. <laughs> oh, Terror of the Deep! Do it! Come on! Nothing! Do it! Gotta get my shit. Okay. Better off with magic. Assess. Assess. Best Let me right. Okay, it's weak to lightning. Shit. Inflicting enough damage on its head while it's in the water will pressure and cause it to take to the air. Attacking the water cells it creates will pop them. Oh god. Water cell. Oh great. Oh great. Oh we've let go! Okay, um, let's, let's assess what we have here. I have no lightning. I have bio. Deal with that. And what do you have, Tifa? How do I get up there? I guess it's time to learn how to do air combat. Oh crap. I wish I had Aerith right now. Or Barret. Take it over. Shit. Better off with magic. Okay, let's see. Spells. Okay, but we probably have some lightning somewhere. No. Triple slash can be used in the air. It's no use. Oh, we're gonna die. I oh god, I'm struggling here. Okay, let's use um Stardust Ray. Oh, you're doing that. Okay, it's pressured. Um pressured. Synergy abilities. Nope, I need to get Tifa abilities. Fiery impulse, icy impulse. I don't have anybody who can do freaking lightning. Staggered. Okay, I need to use stuff with Tifa. I need to use abilities. So let's use dive kick. Loud. We get some Punisher mode. And then let's use Braver. Let's use Unbridled Strength. And we really need... Can I use a Synergy ability? Okay. Relentless Rush. Use on Staggered Foes. Leap in the air and deliver a Spinning Kick. Temporarily grants limited MP. Okay, let's get that. Copy. Do some damage. It's right under us. What the hell? Oh my god. Um. Phoenix down. Let's do this. Okay, I have free cures I can use right now on Cloud. Okay, I think it's over. All set. It's on you. Now or never. Let's go. Uh. Ready. Okay, switch 
the cloud. No, he's bound. Oh god. Oh god. Summon. Titan, sure. Why the hell not? Let's go, Titan. Please help me out. Damn it. Boom, but we're dead. Okay, um... Well, I mean, we're getting there. We're getting there with this guy. She has her limit. I don't know if we're going to be able to stagger him. Um, a uh, high potion. No, high potion. And Cloud. Cloud is dead. When your current party members are in dice straits, you can call upon other comrades to execute a synergy ability at once per battle. Open the commands menu with X and press backline command to select an ability. Backline command. Barrett and Tifa team up to take down an enemy, use on staggered foes to increase potency. They hone their focus, temporarily partitions their ATB gauges into three segments. Tifa uses, makes use of Eric's magic to deal across. Let's use this one. It'll, it'll raise our limit levels. Eric, okay. Do some damage. Ah. Raise our limit levels. Then we'll we'll be able to do Dolphin Fury, which seems very uh Eric like on show. theme. And it missed. Well, now we're oh it looks cool but it missed and we died I I was damn it in this. Oh, that was tough let's try it again i don't think i have the best party for this but i don't i won't i don't want to restart the checkpoint i want to restart at the battle try it again Oh, I can actually change party members. Okay, I want to change to the exact opposite party of what I have here. So let's go to uh, combat settings and let's edit party. And I want um, Aerith and Barrett here. Skip. All right, so Aerith. So it's my turn. Together. All right, let's start with our arcane ward. Just sit tight. We got you. The spell or two ought to speed things up. Hey, oh, shit. Better off with magic. I'm coming. Over here. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Barret. Let's use. Um. Oh, he has lightning. Okay, he has thunder. Let's use thunder. And then. Aerith. Under Cloud, your Aerith. Okay, um, abilities. All right, he doesn't have much. I guess he could stay on heels for the most part. Looking for me? 
Under. It's your turn. Yeah, I'll do it. Hang on. Shit. Fuck, this is so, so annoying. Oh god. to do. Oh, you're fudge. Aerith has her limits. Let's use overcharge. And let's see. I'll get you out. Oh, she can't use it. Hang back. Okay, Barrett. Use some summon abilities for Cloud. Pushing it. Gotta be careful. Oh, I'm messed. I'm messing up my inputs here. Summon abilities. Pair of the deep. Okay, Cloud, please get her out of there. Shit. Okay, you know what? Cure yourself. She's out. Okay. Let's get our fleeting familiar out. Okay. Summon abilities, Lance. Should we try to get this circuitous bolt? Let's not risk it. I got this. Okay, Aerith. Aerith has limit. Healing wind. Bam. Barret. Hang on. Shit. Better off with magic. Fireworks blade. Aerith. 
turret. Here it comes. What the hell you doing? Keep it up. Okay, hold on. Aerith. Use thunder. On Terror of the Deep? It's pressured. Oh, fuck. I'll take care of them. It's your turn. Damn it. So it's my turn? Alright, Aerith, what you got here, girl? What do we want to do? More thunder. There we go. It's your turn. Okay. We gotta overcharge. Oh, and judgment bolt. Tell me. She's so cold. Cloud, we gotta get it in there. Maybe it's time for the long her. mini game. No <laughs> oh shit. Somebody, help! We need to get her breathing again. God, she's so cold. Oh fuck. <laughs> Just stand there, help me. Okay, I've always been really no, bad at this precious. mini game. Got it. I've always been bad at this. <laughs> now, start. Uh. Ah. You picked the wrong girl, creep! What? <sighs> Those guys there are from the Splinter Cell. Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. <sighs> Easy. They're guests of mine. And this one was trying to save your life. He was? Ugh, nice going, Yuffie. Call the guy a creep, why don't ya? You big moron! Okay, Yuffie. Let's get you inside. You've had a rough day. Yeah. Alright. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Not to beat that guy, but kids these days, I swear. Now, now. Who's that? Just a Another teenage one of my ninja. Guests. I seem to get a lot of them when the world's on fire. Woo! That was a tough fight. In these waters. We need to get our aerial combat like so down because I know Cloud and um, Tifa can do it, but oh, I just I don't know, man. Monsters like that one have been cropping up more and more lately. Goddamn reactors to blame. I'm so glad she was. Thanks again. She would have been in deep shit without you. You're welcome. Oh man, it's so amazing seeing these these scenes like just come to life in this game. 
but we missed out on the best two mini games of the whole game actually no 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 we still have to get the dolphin to get us up there right so we didn't we didn't miss that yet i actually hate both of the mini games here <laughs> in the originals so i don't think many people do like the the cpr and like the jumping one but i'm sure if they put them in this it they would have been not as annoying Sorry, Less the janky. ship won't be leaving port until the festivities are over. Ocean's real quiet today. Too quiet. Something's brewing. I can tell you. Look at her go! When an old soul like me says you ought to keep Hey, you guys are that avalanche splinter cell, right? Now, how the hell did you... I just gotta say, I'm a big, huge fan of yours. HQ wishes they could be as cool as you guys. <sighs> well, uh... We are pretty cool, but... Think we could sit down for a chat later? Got a teensy favor to ask. And got a thank you for before. I suppose you could come by the inn tomorrow. Sweet! You won't be sorry. Promise. Later. I can't handle her cuteness. Um... I know, I know. She laid it on pretty thick. She's just but after hey, her material. She's just a kid. What's the harm in hearing her out? Maybe she wants your autograph. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he likes the idea of that. Come on, let's get ourselves some rooms. All right, let's go get our in. <laughs> hey, if it isn't the heroes of the hour, I heard about what you did for that girl. Thank you so much. Your stay is on us. We insist. It's the least we can do for you, really. Now then, how many we got? Will four rooms be enough? <laughs> <laughs> uh, could you make it five? Five it is. Oh, everything is comped. So if you need anything at all, just ask. Don't know about you, but I'm dying to put my feet up. Oh, That's sounds nice like a good deal. Place booked up again for once. Gosh. When was the last time that happened? I mean, it's nice, but we, we ain't paying you, so don't get too excited. Well, look at this. The Kraken. He's drinking some kind of sake that's probably called the Kraken. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, it's Lighthouse. Does your... does your fish sing? Whoa, look at the swordfish. Almost expect like Fisherman's Horizon music to play right now. That would be pretty cool. Poor Red. He's always growling at everybody. Huh? Whose room is this? Is this mine? It's open. Bird. Let's have some bro bonding. Hey, so about that Yuffie kid, what do you think she wants with us? Be honest. Uh, to join your autograph, those Shinra bounties. Your autograph. He Wait, probably won't like that. Your autograph. <laughs> ah, the burden of fame. Okay, okay. He took it the <laughs> he took it the right way. <laughs> <laughs> Always knew this day'd come. Good thing my signature's a work of art. Let me prove it to you. He's not Red 13. Red would not like that answer. Barrett, though, he's all about it. Shinra didn't waste any time getting our names and faces out here, did they? Well, we did kind of really just mess up everything. We destroyed, what, several reactors... Beat the Turks up several times. I felt the same. It was like they were sucking them straight out of my head. Who's she talking to? And the worst part is that I don't even know what's missing. Only that something is. Like it's on the tip of my tongue, but I just can't remember. Damn whispers. 
Speaking of, you seen them lately? <laughs> Cloud. Who's in there with you? Oh. Hmm. Right. Thought it was someone else. That wasn't his voice. No. Nope. I'll clear here, officer. Well, hope the rest of your patrol is just as uneventful. Now hold on a second. Come in. Mind if I take a look around? Hmm? Who's under the bed? Who's in the closet? Empress's scepter. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Empress's scepter. She has Radiant Ward. Conjure a ward that grants invincibility while casting spells. Strengthens her basic attack. Oh, cool. Finish off an enemy with a standard attack launched from within the ward. Proficiency bonus. Okay, yes. Equip that. What's up, girl? I don't know about you, but it feels like we've been on the road forever. Like Midgar's ancient history. No, we're just I gonna start it. Mom and Marlene are holding up. Homesick? Mm -mm. No time for that. Not with Sephiroth around. Mm. So, a little random, but do you remember the first time we met? You shoved a flower at me. <laughs> you shoved a flower in my face. It's called a gift, Cloud. Oh, our, our thought, relationship you know, deepened. In a vase at Seventh Heaven. And I seriously doubt you're the one who put it there. Hey, I mean, you never know. Some advice? Never re-gift a present from a girl. Especially if you're just gonna give it to another one. Noted. Ooh. Water under the bridge. <laughs> next time. Oops, you fucked up. Where do you think those guys in black went? We should have seen them by now. Can't get anything past this girl, can we? Hey, buddy. This town reeks of fish and brine. Should Shinra come calling, I doubt I'll smell them till it's too late. Um. Not good. Huh. Not good. I don't know what to say to this Thankfully, guy. My ears are unaffected. I'll let you know if I hear anything unusual. Okay, I think I made the right choice. I pissed him off last time. My poor nose. Definitely don't want to be rude and say, oh, I never thought you could. just about to come find you yeah I you regret what I said in calm oh come in I should have never doubted you. It's fine. I never should have doubted you either. Say, do you remember a guy named Emilio from Nibelheim? Emilio? Only person from the village I remember is you. Only person from the village I remember is you. Huh? Oh. Okay then. His Are you blushing yet? The general store. Right. 
Anyway, he left the village right before you did. Thought I'd never see him again. Then one day last year, he shows up at Seventh Heaven. I couldn't believe my eyes. He was all grown up. Didn't even recognize him at first. Really? Yeah, and what's more, the woman who walked in with him was stunning. Like, she could have been a model and... Why are you telling us this? <laughs> this is really weird. You're not interested, are you? It's just kind of weird. Not really. But I I'm happy to listen, so go ahead. <laughs> it's okay. Forget it. Cloud sure is a wave with words. Us. No, it wasn't. I... <sighs> Why deny it? I guess it was, huh? I'm sorry. It's fine. We'll find time to talk. Just the two of us. Figure things out. Just be ready to spill your guts, huh? <laughs> With my iron stomach? <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. I played Crisis Core. Night. You're not getting that one by me, Mr. Cloud. must be my room. What else can we explore? Oh my god, it's so dark. What the hell? There we go. Anybody here play Queen's Blood? Oh, Materia. Lightning materia. Happy to have it. All right, now we can rest. Yes. Yeah, iron stomach, huh? Mm-hmm. 